Good afternoon, YouTube. Today we'll be unboxing the Hembor Outdoor Collapsible Utility Wagon. Let's get started. Actually, before we get started, let me show you the uh, actual product description. There we go. Yeah, so let's get started. Looks pretty simple. Piece of metal in there. Be careful. Let's see if we can get a dent on the side of this box. There we go. Interesting. Okay, so it comes pre collapsed. Apparently, else it was a fit in the box. So, I'm assuming that this is the base where the wheels attach. And, fresh out, we already have the instruction manual. Very simple. Just one page of instructions. And as a matter of fact, just one instruction, for as far as I can tell. Yeah. Um, five parts, not including the actual frame. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be easy. I just see some wheels, bolts, and screws. Let's uh, get started, yeah. First step, one wheel, two bolts, three, a nut. Very straightforward. So probably one for each wheel on one side, so let's take out uh, one of each. Put this stuff out the way. As well as this in the picture and number three it says a net but there's also a washer washer in there with it so it makes sense you always use a washer whenever you use one of these anyway so fair enough where did i put the washer oh, right there um that's about it This goes right after the washer. Hold on a minute. This can't be right. This can be right. This to show you guys in real time just how easy this thing really is or how hard it is. So right off the bat, these things barely fit and you're gonna have to press them really tight together. Initial set up right there. They're not too hard. You can, I can bend these with my hands, so I'm not too worried about it. And I'm not using any tools yet. As you can tell already, one leg in there. This is probably going to be a breeze. And let me shut up before I jinx myself. All right. This probably would have been easier if I would have flipped it upside down, which I think I'm going to do after I screw this one in. I actually really thought about flipping it upside down when I first opened it. It's a handle. It's very strange. It's there. Go back in the picture, so and I got it. Dump the rest of this stuff out. There's not very many parts. If this isn't the easiest thing I've bought on Amazon to assemble, I don't know what is. I've seen the reviews saying the parts are bad fitting. I kind of agree. I gotta use a little bit of brute force. I'm doing this with my hands. This part might be a little bit interesting. There's not really any instructions on this, but I'm assuming you just drop it in there and it fits. Whatever. Alright, that one fit. 
best out of all of them so far, but I don't think that matters. At least so far. I'll come back to that and tighten those up later. After this video, but let's flip this thing over. Some more instructions. Well, uh, I don't know if it takes a rocket scientist to put this thing together. Assuming. Don't know how much I like this. Oh, wait. Well, one. Fit some bars. Oh, huh. Is it Velcro? Look at that. It's Velcro. I was wondering. Isn't that? So you guys get to see firsthand. Somebody's probably going to buy this and be like, hey, I don't want to rip this 53 bars, but that didn't make a lot of sense. I'm glad I kind of thought that through a little bit more. Obviously, you don't pull up the handles. This does not fit into this hole, so I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. I'm assuming I am. That's what it shows in the picture. Let's try this again. Let's see, if you look in here, this screw is has a very sharp end, like it wasn't sanded down all the way. And I think that might be on purpose cool thing is I have a drill for later so this doesn't go in right here in this video and it looks like it is lots and lots of brute force <clears throat> I shouldn't have to do this with my hands but fine just for video purposes there you go now we go get the power tools boom this thing is assembled. Cup holders. Let's rotate this thing around so you guys can see it with the cup holders on it. Uh, nice, let's put something in it. Wait right there. There we go. Unboxing done. 